Where are you at, tourist? Gotta talk ASAP. Beep us. Tourist, thanks for coming. Where's Sable? Oh, she's fine. At least I hope she is without her. I don't know. She found out about a convoy leaving the tower. Shitload of supplies on trucks. Huge operation. It's our chance to swap ammo for the exiles. I've been talking to a bunch of them ever since you hooked us up. They are aggro as a pack of rougarous. We get this ammo to them, it's all gonna go down. Fuck yeah! I knew she could do it. What's the plan? Meet Sable and Barnes on tower grounds. Parking garage, second floor. That's the staging area for the convoy. Stealth is key, so go at night. Sable's gonna snap a lock to an unguarded entrance that will get you past the perimeter and onto tower grounds. Billy Bolt Cutters to the rescue once again. Hooray for Billy. Not sure what we'd do without him. People said you had a sense of humor. Kinda have to when everything's this fucked up. JB was a jokester too. Not sure if you're aware of that. JB seemed pretty serious to me. Yeah, he was that too. He had it all. Really thought he was the answer to all that ailed this city. I guess I was wrong. Oh well, not this time around though. My gut is telling me that I'm gonna be on the winning side for once in my life. Maybe this was part of JV's vision all the while. The long game. Enough about the past, though. This here is the future, and you gotta get to making it. Bone chance, tourist. Later that night. mess in the first place. anymore. I 
handle it. That creature's gonna squirm when Mama gets her hands on him. Preacher boy's got it coming. Nobody talks shit about the tower. Fuck no. I'd shoot him on sight. Don't want to catch anything. Damn, I hate being out when it's dark. Religion is a powerful drug, and he's got all the exiles hooked. Preacher boy's got it coming. Nobody talks shit about the tower. Tourist, over here. You made it. Were you followed? Feeling a little paranoid? You could say that. Our plan is fucked. We never should have trusted that son of a bitch. One of our friends on the inside told us there'd be ammo in these crates. Turns out it was bad intel. Every damn one of them has a generator in it. I'm telling you, we were lied to. This is a setup. Generators again? What are they planning to do with them? Don't know, but our time's running out. Where can we find the ammo? There's a warehouse just north of here. It's been heavily guarded by an eradicator unit for the past few days. Around the clock, trucks have been coming and going. The ammo could be in there. We need to know what Mama's up to. That warehouse will tell us. We need you to check it out, tourist. We're already taking a huge risk by breaking curfew. Look for the old fishery sign. June Accord. Best way in is through the loading dock. We're gonna meet Echo in front of the clinic. See what you can find and meet us there. And please, keep it quiet. We will die like dogs if anyone finds us out here.
priest is nuts. He thinks unity will save us. But it's unity that got us into this mess in the first place. Key to Mama's plan. Look at this. What is it? Plans for mechanized bell rigs. Powered by all those goddamn generators. Mama took down Old Town. Via Corolla, too. Jesus Christ. New Orleans is fucked. Mama's built enough of these rigs to destroy the whole city. Eliminate the exiles. Wipe the slate clean. A bunch of old towns. All at once. Like a nuclear bomb. It's not over. We can stop her, with or without the exiles. We have to. We need a fight. Now. Oh, tourist, got a pretty big list over here with your name on it. For a friend, they won't be needing it till tomorrow. Ah, 
love it when a deal comes together. <laughs> this network's the real deal. There's real hope around here now. You can see it in people's eyes. It's a tough road going it alone. That's the tourist?
die, asshole! I'd be dead already if you Let's run! Hate's not a- lunatic who wants us all dead. Think you can fuck with us and get away with it? Heard something.
everything they've got they stole from us. Priest is nuts. He thinks unity will save us, but it's unity that. Can
I'll just leave you to the walkers. Ah. to one last week. Reminded me of my friend JG. Two foot long beard. Hope he didn't give me anything. As long as I'm fed and safe, I could give two shits about power politics. You messed up starting shit up today. that just won't die. You have arrived. Finally. I always pictured you taller. Better looking. Likewise. <laughs> the legendary tourist quip. I suppose I should be flattered. Sunrise is beautiful from up here. I never miss one. Yeah. It's a gorgeous view. Today was supposed to be a celebration. 
but it has turned into a day of reckoning. You're a survivor. There are fewer of us every day. I was. By making decisions that others would not. Impossible decisions. I agonized over what had to be done this time. The destruction of my beloved city. I take zero pleasure in it. But I am curious. Through the eyes of a legendary lone wolf, why do you think I would even consider such a course of action? You're afraid? Afraid of the alternatives. Yes. I was just like everyone else, tourist. I believed the reserve was salvation. But fate had other plans. When you uncovered that empty hole in the ground, I had to pivot. I spent weeks crunching the numbers. Only one thing became clear. Without a culling, starvation and disease would overtake us all in a matter of months. I had a choice to make. Allow fate to run its chaotic course once again and surrender the entire city to the dead. Or defy fate, take matters into my own hands, and save a precious few by slaughtering the many. I chose defiance. What you chose was mass murder. I chose the future. The tower as an ark for those with the metal to rebuild a new world. Turning my back on so many people I loved in favor of pure survival. Can you even comprehend how difficult that is? But none of it matters now, does it? The bells ring. The plan is set in motion, but my victory is hollow. Treachery is everywhere, and I am alone. Where did I go wrong? Tell me. You messed with me. Big mistake. Nothing personal, tourist. For what it's worth, I always had a feeling we would have a chat like this. You and I are very much alike. I ain't nothing like you. You are a survivor. No matter the cost. I am wired the exact same way. But for me, right now, that cost has gotten unbearably high. The roots of treachery have dug their way deep into my story, choking the life out of me from within. The bodies around the table inside, they were not the first to betray me. One of them poisoned this drink, their mind corrupted by some movement within my lower ranks. The assassin would not reveal himself, of course, so my hand was forced. Garrick and May? I considered them family. But their ambition outweighed their loyalty. I learned they were plotting to murder me in my sleep, tourist. Simply because we didn't see eye to eye on how to manage the tower population. Like a fool, I spared them. Thought they would come to their senses outside the tower walls, on the run and alone was wrong. And then there was JB, my right hand. There were warning signs early on that the pressure was getting to him, that he was on the verge of snapping. But I dismissed them. I loved him like my own son, protected him when others called for his head. And how did he repay my loyalty? He tried to burn me alive and started a war over ideology. Every decision I have made has been in the service of other people, tourist. With the target on my back the entire time. My head on the block waiting for the blade to drop. 
no more. You've let fear rot your brain. Great leaders inspire loyalty in their people, and they keep it. But I could not. Look out over our glorious city, tourist. Tell me, what do you see? I see opportunity. You sound like me. So long ago, this is the key to the city's future. It unlocks a control panel behind you. There is a button that will turn off the lights, and without the lights, the bells will fall silent. But heed my words, Taurus. Letting the bells ring is an act of mercy. The slate will be wiped clean, and only those with the fortitude necessary to preserve humanity will remain and rebuild. They will thrive. But if you silence the bells, you will only prolong the suffering for all. The fate of this city will be sealed. The dead will prevail. I've made my choice. And have paid the price for it. Now, it is time for you to make yours. Let the bells ring. Well done. You are a servant to the greater good. Like myself. Welcome home, tourist. Well, tourist. Looks like you chose to end this tale in flames. Not the path I'd have taken, but what do I know? I'm just a dead man. No different from all those folks whose fate you sealed by allowing the bells to toll. Mama's new heaven. She saw something in you, Taurus. A kindred spark. I know you like to think of yourself as the lone wolf, but take a moment to contemplate this. She may have been playing you the whole while. Got exactly what she wanted from the only soul she thought capable of taking her place. But you're the one left standing. The one who has to deal with the aftermath. Good luck with that, tourist. You're sure as hell gonna need it. No, you're not going out this way. You need to suck it up. Just fucking shoot me. May the Lord protect me and deliver me unto eternal life. Seems you have more of a heart than I gave you credit for. I won't trouble you for anything else. Redemption is an option, Padre. If you go out swinging, maybe that's proof that your people didn't die in vain. Mama was right about one thing. A man like you would be useful in the dark times ahead. You've been kind to me in your way, tourist. Perhaps what you're saying holds a kernel of truth. Goodbye, and thank you. But if I need to die today because of it, then I will. That's fine. Go, go on ahead. Go on and pull the trigger, babe. Because I ain't letting you go. You're this harder than I thought it would be. Don't do it. Put the gun down.
If I was in your spot, I'd have been screaming for revenge. But you saved me, and I owe you for that. You don't owe me, Sonny. If it was me on the other side of the glass, you'd be dead. You owe her. You're right. I do. I'm sorry, Dez. For everything. Looks like you're gonna be stopping real soon. <laughs> be gone, demon. for you to make yours. Give me the key. The demon in disguise. Why am I not surprised? Welcome to hell, tourist. Looks like you chose to raise the city up on your shoulders instead of raising it to the ground. I guess you could say I'm a bit surprised. Didn't take you for an optimist. Manola ain't out of the woods just yet. Mama may be gone, but the darkness she embraced didn't start or end with her. It's still out there, tourists deep in the souls of the living, biding its time. Now, of course, there's light out there, too. That spark of humanity. And with a dash of hope, that spark will grow into a rage in the fire and spread to every corner of this new world. All thanks to you, tourists. 